Metroid Prime is considered one of the best video games in the saga. Samus Return to Nintendo Video Consoles, back in 2002, meant the consolidation of Retro Studios as one of the most fit development teams, at that time, of the Japanese company. The title has staunch defenders, and it is a video game experience that remains fully valid to this day. Surely that's what they think from Scoo Team, a small development team that is carrying out a remake of the mythical video game that aims to move it to a two-dimensional environment. Its creators, who have been running for quite some time now, have just announced that it already has a playable demo so we can taste its honeys. The title of the work is none other than Prime 2D, and has been in development since. Nothing more ran nothing less, than 2004. In charge is a group of people composed of programmers and volunteer workers who have been silently biting the key for more than a decade. On the project's own website, its communication team defines the title as follows. Prime 2D has always been approached as a fan project for the pleasure of creating and learning, something that has been exemplified by many previous collaborators who used the skills learned in this project as a way to enter the gaming industry. As the project has matured, so have we as creators, raising the level of quality expected of a game. Instead of copying exactly the original material, we focus on taking the basics, translating them and then implementing them in a logical 2D solution. This announcement about the current availability of a playable demo has undoubtedly given a boost to the project in terms of relevance. And this is something that has a double face, since just as many more players will know, from today, the existence of this developing title, Nintendo's gaze on it will also intensify. Which means that surely your lawyers will not take long to go for a walk, if they have not already done so. So, if you are curious, do not hesitate to download the demo sooner rather than later, because it would not be surprising if at any moment it disappeared from the map.